I'm not sure whether or not people say that all oh, Apple intelligence is good, but is it actually good enough? Let's find out. But we're doing this all on my MacBook Air, and I had to start off by Siri because they say that Siri has been improved. Let's find out. Have you been improved recently, Siri? Okay. That wasn't helpful. Tell me a few points about assistive technology. Would you like me to use Chat GPT to answer that? Can Siri just tell me about what things are? Rather than just asking me, oh, can you use ChatGPT? Well, in that case, I'd just press yes. Now, it is kind of good that what ChatGPT is doing with Siri, but I would prefer that if it just reads out to me, that would be more better rather than me reading everything down. Even better, if Siri was integrated with ChatGPT, I'll just ask something and then ChatGPT would just kick in if Siri can't find anything. Because usually with Siri, it just gives you like random links, which is not that helpful. I guess one feature that people are hyping about the photo editor inside the photos app has to be the cleanup feature, which is alright-ish, kind of. I could not use Image Playground because none of my photos are in the photos app. They're mostly in my Google Photos where all my videos and photos are stored in. I do not like Gemmoji because whatever I describe, it just does not give to me and that's inside the messaging app. Like really? You know what, I'll just stick with the normal emojis. Forget Gemmoji because it just wouldn't even show me anything. Now what I do like about in the notes app is that when you select the text, you have the options for writing tools and in there you have rewrite, proofread, and then you can change different tones from friendly, professional or concise. Say, let's say if I want to have it more friendly, it will just generate the text, make it more friendly and casual, but not as casual, I think. But it's getting there. But think about this, guys. There is ups and downs within Apple Intelligence, but I think most of them are running in beta, so they're not fully, fully completed. As long as they are improved to be, they have more updates, Siri is getting much better with ChatGPT integration which is still in beta but why late though? They announced it like last year in the WWDC but think about it Galaxy AI they were straight away brought it over to the S24 and then they brought it over to the other devices like the Z Flip, Fold, Tabs, Watches, you name it but then Apple Intelligence they came a bit late but I'm sure there's going to be updates from time to time like in future updates or something. Some of them you can't get wrong with the features inside Apple Intelligence. But